Welcome to the 10 Days of Happiness. My name is Edwin Edebury, the Chief Happiness Officer. Today, we are in day number two, and we will be talking about smiling and laughing at yourself. Yes, you're not going crazy, you're not insane. It is a lot of fun when you can get to that point where you can really, really laugh at yourself. And actually, smiling and laughing are the same thing. You know, smiling is just laughing quietly, okay, and moving your facial muscles. Whereas smiling is laughing without the sound itself. So whether you smile or you laugh, enjoy it because number one, it's good for your mental outlook. It really helps your health. You can heal quickly. You know, science has shown us folks who smile and laugh a lot, they can heal themselves very quickly. As a matter of fact, smiling and laughing is contagious. I'm telling you, you want to drag, dr attract happy people to your life? Laugh a lot, smile a lot. They will come to you. Try frowning and you will scare people away very quickly. You wonder, they say, oh, that go that person and they all just start whisking away. So I cannot overemphasize how much role smiling and happiness do to happiness to, and laughing do to your life. Now, when you get in a very tough situation and you feel like you beat yourself, don't do that. Because if you beat yourself, who is going to come to your rescue? Nobody. So, I don't want to overemphasize the value that smiling and laughing do to happiness. But these are some of the things you can put to work for you. Number one, is just make a commitment to smile and laugh more. That's all it usually takes. And then now you're going to be conscious of it. Number two, hang around people who are funny. They will make you laugh, even if you don't want to laugh. Even if you're going through some very tough times, they will touch that button of you and you will laugh. Number three is just smile a lot all the time. And I know it's tough in the very beginning, but it's like new habits. You know, we have to work on it. Remember this, folks. Practice does not make perfect. It never does. Practice makes improvement. So if you practice to laugh more and practice to smile more, you're going to get better at it then this is another thing you can do. You can read or watch jokes and just keep it clean, okay? But the truth about it is they are good for your heart and they're good for your soul. And they keep funny pictures. You know, pictures, and, and I'm not talking bad pictures, now. I'm just saying funny ones, things that really give you that giggle. And then remember, nothing works by itself. You have to make the damn thing work. And that's what Mos Edison told us. And so that's the same thing with smiling and laughing. But I'm telling you, if you do it enough, it will become second habit, and that will just be one form of happiness you never have to worry about. So that's day number two. Join us as we go into day number three.